Can you read the Indian language from the nation of India? No, I cannot. Well, then, how can you tell that there is no great literature anywhere else? Have you ever read the Vedas? It's been translated into English. Have you read it? Not those particular things, no. <laughs> so, what have you read? Um, oh, just different legends, you know, like legends of the Navajos and... You know, because, see, I'm into mythology. I'm, I'm really into different mythology. Yeah, I, 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 yeah, Greek yeah. and Roman the mythology is, like, very, very cool. And then when you get into other mythologies, it's like, you know, it just goes down into just stupidity. You know, so the Greeks and Romans, you know, they uh, were, like, light years ahead even, in, even back then. I don't know. I See, I can't convince you, man. If you, if you think that, it's, that this is a great place the way it is, then... You know? The reason you can't convince me is you have no argument. Your argument is based upon the fact that you just absolutely cannot stand other people. Anybody who doesn't look and smell and taste and feel and dress like you and live like you, to you, doesn't belong on this earth. Isn't that correct? Well, at least not in this country. They can find their own damn country, can't they? What do you mean find their own? This is their country. Anyone born in this country is a citizen of this country. Anyone born is a, in any state of the 50 states is a citizen of that state. It's their country. Well, I wish I had the money to leave. Well, why don't you? Why don't all you guys get together, pool your money, buy some island somewhere, get your rowboat, row out to your island, make your uh, Fourth Reich, and you'll all be happy. If there was a place to go, believe me, I'd make the effort to go there. There are places to go. Why don't you look around? Why don't you get together with all your buddies, throw all your money into the pot, Buy you an island somewhere and, uh, you know, get you a boat and get yourselves out there. Make your own country. Make your fourth right. You can run around killing each other. I guarantee you after a while, you know, you're not going to like each other either. Because you have a problem that has nothing to do with what you're talking about. Yeah. Well, I don't know what that problem would be other than... I know you, know, you like don't. I, said, Mike. I know you don't. That's why you put it off on other people. But the problem's in you. It's not in those other people. There's nobody running around uh, making you go to bed with anybody. You can go to bed with whoever you want. So if your race is being diluted, you're the one diluting it. And if you can't find uh, a woman of the same race as you, if that's the kind of woman that you want, then you better sit down and ask yourself, what's wrong with you? I never said that they were forcing me, but, you know, you turn on MTV any day and you... Uh hear this rap music playing and you and what they are doing is they basically uh are, are getting the young children that are between say 10 and uh 14 and 15 and they're filling uh, their heads with this garbage i mean a no, lot of no, people no they're not nobody is going up to anybody and knocking on their head and opening up their skull and shoving music down their brain these people are going and buying the music that they want to hear nobody's forcing them to buy it nobody's forcing them to listen to it the black rappers are not making music for little white children to screw with their brains. Their music is for blacks. If you listen to it, it's black music for blacks. If white children like it, there's, there's nothing that you're going to do about that. People are going to gravitate to what they like, whether you like it or not. Well, I think that's an awfully sad... I guess you think freedom is sad? I guess well Don't you I guess when you're free to just completely uh ruin what was a good idea and America was a good idea two hundred years ago, but I guess if that's what freedom's all about, then okay. Well if if you're talking about hold on just a second. If you're talking about the fact that we are all all of us, of all races and all religions who are Americans are losing our freedoms and we need to get our freedoms back, then I'm with you. If you're talking about just you need America the way it was 200 years ago and everybody who doesn't look like you and dress like you and live in the same house as you can't have that, then you're wrong. And, and it's not going to be that way. 